Hello and welcome. Here we are again uh, in this very very special episode. We are previewing the India Pakistan match to be played in Manchester tomorrow from an astrological perspective. I have with me Mr. Greenstone Lobo. He is a sports astrologer. And so, Mr. Lobo, how how do you look at the India Pakistan game tomorrow? Let me let me get into this chat straight away. Who is going to win the game? Huh, so you got into the question directly, is it? And you want me to answer the question directly? Okay, so let me say this. Uh, I don't know. I'm afraid uh, if I'm having good news. Um, uh, well, India will not win this match. If you think I'm going to be saying like this, no, you're mistaken. Okay, India is going to win this match. Let me tell you that. I hope you know what happened during the Champions Trophy Finals. India lost that game. Fakazama surprised all of us on that day. You know, Hardik Pandya tried his best but could not. I mean, I hope you, this time your predictions are right about the game. Okay, so in fact, uh, that match is exactly what I have in mind and that is the reason I am saying this prediction, okay. See, Sarfaraz Ahmed has got a very good chart, so we, need to, we shouldn't forget that. He's born in 1987, he's born just about, you know, near Djokovic, okay. He has a very good horoscope. Uranus is very powerfully placed. Neptune is very powerfully placed. And he was supposed to win uh, an ICC tournament. It was there in his charts. And uh, he was supposed to win an ICC tournament, which is a little smaller one. You know, It's not a bigger tournament that he was supposed to win. So he has won it. So that is exactly the reason why he bet us in, uh, in the Champions Trophy and he won uh, the you know, Champions Trophy for his, for his country. But you know what happens is, in a, in a World Cup scenario, the World Cup is uh, something even bigger. And India-Pakistan matches are always bigger. They are larger than life. In fact, you always think about them. You always talk about them even after uh, you know a few decades. So this match is not going to be an exception. This is going to be an amazing match which all of us are going to talk about. And when we talk about higher class matches, you know matches of extraordinary proportions, that is when the captains with fantastic charts come into play. And that is exactly where someone like a Virat Kohli is going to come into play. Virat Kohli has got an exceptional horoscope. Okay, he was supposed to lose an ordinary match. I mean, if you compare to uh, the World Cup match, a Champions Trophy pales in comparison. And the World Cup match, which matters the most, is going to is, is what he's going to win. And he's going to ensure that India is going to have this record against Pakistan intact once again. I was, I was, I was about to ask you that about this fabulous record that India has against Pakistan. They have never lost to Pakistan at a World Cup. And that record is going to continue. Yeah, yeah. Unko abhi bhi sochte rehna padega. Moka aayega karke. So it's going to take them a long time. Uh, one more time, we would win the match. See, I'll tell you the the reason uh, is not just about uh, Virat Kohli's horoscope. It's also about the entire uh, the team that has been formed this time. Okay. So we have uh, we have MS Dhoni still there in in place. We have a KL Rahul in place. Okay. We have a now we have like two spinners. Okay. Who are also extremely good. They have this. They are Kuldeep and uh, you know Chahal have got fantastic charts. So besides the superb batsmen that we have, we also have a fantastic bowling lineup. Again, I'm talking all from the uh, astrological perspective. They have like fabulous chart, and compared to that uh, Pakistan team which won against us in Champions Trophy, it's a better team. Definitely a much much better team. So we're going to win this time. Yeah. Hardik Pandya last time was fighting hard. Yeah. This time, he could be scoring all those runs in winning cause. Yeah. In fact, this time it's going to be a huge team effort. Okay. I'm not seeing one player playing, uh, uh, you know, upper hand. Yeah, there could be, there could be one player, you know, playing, doing well. You can have a Kale Rahul or you can have a Rohit Sharma blasting away to glory. Okay, but it's not. It's going to be an absolutely wonderful team effort. Every player is going to play uh, very good roles, and you're going to have a superbly. It's going to be a very satisfactory match, match for the Indians, you know, from the Indian cricketers' perspective. Let's talk about uh, Mohammad Amir. You know, he uh, he he has been doing well. He has been sometimes out of form. So, how do you see him uh, doing doing this match? What 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 do the stars say? In fact, he was a he was a trump card last time. Yeah. Okay, uh, he was the linchpin. Okay, and uh, he destroyed actually uh, the Indian yeah. uh, batting lineup. But he cannot do that same thing again. I mean, he won't be able to repeat the performance because uh, he has a planet which is which was very strong in 2000, uh, you know, 17, which is now weak. So that is one of the reason why he won't be able to do. So he's not going to be the player who's going to make a difference for Pakistan. Yeah. You know, Pakistan is carrying with them a bowler who they say can bowl 150, hmm. Hasnan. Do you think he, they can 
Pakistan can unleash him during this during this all important game and gain something out of him? I, I don't know. Probably they are keeping it as a uh, unknown quantity, you know, and they may unleash against us. So, uh, this guy has got a very good horoscope. I mean, he's born in 2000. He has got uh, Pluto and uh, Uranus in very strong position. So, he does uh, pose a threat. But I don't think he's going to be a threat as big as Mohamed Amir was in the, uh, you know, in the Champions Trophy. See, it's going to be very easy. Uh, we are going to bulldoze Pakistan. Okay. <laughs> and that's a, that's a big word. Yeah. So, so finally, your three big players from each side that we can expect to do well. Okay, so uh, if you go to Pakistan uh, perspective, it's going to be Fakhar Zaman for sure. Uh, it's going to be Shoaib Malik and Mohammed Afiz. I mean, the old uh, war the oldies, horses are yeah. going to the oldies are going to be the ones who are going to be playing well. Okay, and Mohammed uh, Amir can also be chipping in. Okay, so so I can say these are the players from India's perspective: Virat Kohli and Rohit Sharma, and one of the um, one of the uh, I mean, I would say Jasprit Bumrah again. And uh, I would always want uh, uh, you know Mohammed Shami to play, and if he plays, he's going to be also be playing a very very important role. So, Mr. Lobo, as a lot of Indians, uh, not lot of Indians, all the Indians who are following the game would want to hear, your predictions are India going to win or rather what, what's the word that you used? Bulldoge. Yes, India will bulldoze Pakistan. Thank yeah. you, Mr. Lobo. Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot uh, for being with us uh, and best of luck for the game to you also. Oh, okay, fine. Yeah, best of luck Indian team.